One thing I want to talk about is you've been known to have the top most crisp boxing in UFC history. It's phenomenal how good your striking is, your speed. What do you think about this uh, battle of two strikers? We see Ilya, we see Max. They're going to be going to battle at UFC 308. Um, that's uh, 1026, I think October 26th. Abadali. Something like that, yeah. That's so what, what do you think about those two guys in their boxing? Man, uh, Ilya has really uh, surprised me a lot. I think he's sharp clean his body work his 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 composure inside there you mm -hmm. know um was was phenomenal when he fought Emmett you know I know how tough Emmett is and he's a good solid boxer hard to put away tough as nails and you see in that fight it was like wow like Ilya really put put it on him um with Max I think Max is you know hitting that stride again you know like he just had that big win over uh Gaethje you know, never, no, never one's ever knocked Gaethje out, mm -hmm. you know, in that kind of fashion. Oh, he had never been knocked out before? No. No. Not like that. Not, not out cold. No, not he's that. been like TKO. Yeah. Yeah. I think TKO, oh, yeah. Okay. Even at TKO, he's still like, you know, yeah. I think, well, who, who uh, was it? Alvarez? Yeah. Eddie yeah. Alvarez, maybe? Oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah. 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 But, uh, man, that's, that's a tough one. But do you think Max, I, I don't think Max, I love Max to death. I don't yeah. think he mixes it enough as, for mixed martial arts. You know, he's he boxing heavy, doesn't throw too many kicks. You look at the Volkanovski fights. Yeah. He didn't really mix it together. You know what I mean? To the MMA together. Yeah. You know, um, I thought those fights were super close. He won, won, won some of them, you know, they gave him the Volk. But with, with Illy, you know, he, he wrestles, he grapples, you know, he, he does it all. He kicks. Um, but I'm excited to see, like, he, Max is so long, so rangy, mm -hmm. um, super tough, got a granite chin, tough Hawaiian. That's a, that's a, a fight that I'm pretty intrigued by. You yeah. kind of see the outcome, see how it unravels. I think you'll see, you know, if later in the rounds, third, fourth round, fifth round, championship rounds are going to really, I think, pay off for maybe Max. Mm -hmm. um, but Ily starts high, you know what I mean? He has a high pace. Yeah. Um, seeing how he can carry that over because, you know, Max got good cardio. He's been in those five-round wars, you know, fights and prevailed so many times. I think that's about as to his experience. With, with, with two high level fighters, who has the most experience, who has the best camps, who comes in healthiest. Mm. Um, I think that's all plays a, a huge part of, you know, who's going to win the fight. Yeah. What do you think about Max? Max's striking is insane, but Ilya is probably, I would say, Clean. top boxing in the UFC right now. I mean, from what I've heard from other fighters, from what I've personally seen, and I'm not saying I'm an expert, but his boxing looks insane. What do you think is going to happen between those two guys? Man, um, it, it'll be hard for it for me to bet against Max at his last performance. Yeah. yeah. He's tough, dude. He's tough. He's tough. He's got a, He's got this um, aura to him right now that I think even a fighter knows, like, damn, if you could do that to Gaethje and Gaethje couldn't kind of knock you off your stool, then I feel like that type of, even as a fighter, even when we're done with these podcasts and we talk to fighters, like, even fighters have this sense of other fighters of, like, yeah, this guy's in a moment right now, like you just mentioned. Right. And with Gaethje, too, he's um, developed a lot of... Uh, I'd say higher IQ mm -hmm. in fighting. Mm -hmm. I, you know, his last few fights, man, he really impressed me. 